Reading 1 Once upon a time, there lived an old shoemaker and his wife near a dense forest. They were very poor. One day, there was nothing left in the house to eat. The shoemaker only had leather for one pair of shoes. He decided to make shoes from the last piece of leather and sell it into the market for food. He thus cut the leather and left it on the bench in his shop. When he went to his shop next morning, he was surprised to see a pair of shoes all nicely made and ready to be sold. The shoes were so well made that they were sold quickly. With the money, the poor shoemaker bought leather for two pairs of shoes. So, he cut out the leather for the shoes and left it on his bench. The next morning, when he went into his shop to make the shoes, he found two pairs of shoes already made. Those shoes were also sold very quickly. Every day, he used to cut the leather and the next day, he got the shoes made. Slowly, he became a very rich shoemaker. One day, he decided to sit up all night hidden in his shop to find out who is the person who helps him. So, he cut out leather for a few pairs of shoes and hid it in his shop. As soon as the midnight struck, he saw two dwarfs quietly entering the shop. They made the shoes from the leather. The next day, the shoemaker told his wife about the whole incident. Both of them decided to gift the dwarves for their good deed. The shoemaker's wife decided to make beautiful clothes for the dwarves. The shoemaker decided to make shoes for them. One evening, when the gifts were ready, the shoemaker and his wife kept the clothes and shoes on the bench for the dwarfs and hid in the shop. The dwarfs came and were surprised to find the gifts. They wore the clothes and the shoes and went into the woods dancing merrily. Reading 2 Bed in Summer In winter, I get up at night and dress by yellow candlelight. In summer, quite the other way. I have to go to bed by day. I have to go to bed and see. The birds still hopping on the tree. Or hear the grown-up people's feet still going past me in the street. And does it not seem hard to you when all the sky is clear and blue? And I should like so much to play to have to go to bed by day by Robert Louis Stevenson.